All right, and we are back with another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Now, we are meeting up with Sebastian for the next Unforgivable Curse. I believe it's Imperial. So. You're here. Good. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned... I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them, so I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. Eh? I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it. But I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. Student report. Uh. The catacomb assignment yielded more than night and magic. Um, learning about our ancestors was illuminating. However, I stumbled upon something else I could not ignore. In an area behind the great room which had suffered decay, amid the turned over sarcophagi. Sarcophagi. I discovered an oddly shaped relic. Immediately, I sensed its power. I would be thrilled to study the relic further, if only for the removal of the objects were allowed. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Well, let's go find out. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Oh, uh, hold up. Um. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna transform the spiders. Seems, uh, I don't know what. Good for you. Incendies. At least now we know we're not alone. Perhaps that was it. And the rest of the tomb will be insect free. Yeah, spiders are insects. Don't start. Hmm. I mean, they're not. Akio! We're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is justified. Akio! Wingardium Leviosa! This room is taller than it looks. Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Rebellion. Brilliant. Bits of armor collection. Accio. I wonder what I found there. Is that everything? Rebellion. Looks like it. Alright, further in. Transformation spell, transfiguration spell has a very long cooldown. For me. Rebellion. Um, let me grab this. Then we'll go down this way. Through the door that was closed. Watch your step. Hey, what's up, Thunder Waffle? Here. 
Uh, am I poisoned? Because I'm taking damage. All this grass. It no longer feels like a tomb. I've read about catacombs that underwent expansion efforts and ran into problems. Often cave-ins. Incendies. And then were abandoned. Exactly. We'll be fine, though. Revelio. Contrigo. Money? And I believe we go this way. Yeah. Now this is the sort of great room I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Could bring you an old pile of bones. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. There's something here by the altar. Accio. Could bring you. Incendium. Accio. Alright. Oh no. I foolishly mentioned the relic in my report and was reminded to leave it where it lay. But research must come before my fealty to the rule. Oh, of course. I sense something about this relic. I was told that the Chosen by English Oak Wan a powerful intuition. I believe it. Therefore, when no one was looking, I acted. I conjured two barricades to isolate the relic. Ancestors forgive me, but I used their very bones as the key. I plan to return to it, but first I must ready myself for our next assignment. Learning the Imperious Curse. The spell is said to serve well against enemies. What did you find? Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic, and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the Great Room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades, I'll look around and see what we missed. Hold on to that diary entry, there may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperious Curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. Do you think the pages were left here on purpose? Slytherin mentioned a student who excelled in charms and always carried a satchel stuffed full of notes. They might have been left on purpose. Or the student may have simply dropped them. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. Look, bones stacked oddly on either side of this archway. Hmm. Leave no stone unturned. Mm -hmm. Or in this case, no Yeah, bone. so the next giveaway will be in March for Resident Evil 5, uh, 4 remake giveaways. Um, there may or may not be something else in between. Just, can find a way you know, it depends on how active we can be here. We can be extra active. Uh, there's another game that's coming out in between then that we could try to do a giveaway. We've made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. Wait, can I go above? Looks like there was enough room. Nope, oh, guess not. How's your day going, duckies? What are you up to? Alright, all I need to do is figure out... Ah, I see. 
We'll go from an after 30 minutes go tired. How about you? Oh, I, I was definitely tired. I I was up very late. Arrest the momentum. And uh Akio. Can we target this instead? There we go. So the day's been slow. But yes, I, I too am tired. Oh. Or, did it open? Good for you. I have to put more there? Rebellion. Maybe I do. Oh, I guess I just take the stairs. Would make sense. But yeah, just trying to chill out. Oh, did you, um... If I, and I forgot if we already talked about it. Did you have to end up waiting until the 10th to play the game? Okay, well I'm in this room. I'm not sure what I am doing. I can pull skeletons apart all I want. Oh boy. Oh man. Oh boy. Okay, so this stuff wants to go back to where I just had it. Sorely. Okay. And what? Global Part 2 Live, easy as and new. Nice, nice. No, you haven't given a shot because I left Friday evening. I like to be- yeah, right, 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 okay, makes sense, makes sense. Alright, well... I'm not sure... What to do to have I- I haven't been in here, I guess. We're in two. I assume eerie sounds come with the territory. So... Is this the last set of bone? Ah, yes. You've done it. I knew we'd get through. What about that I up felt there? It's in my bones. Nice. I, hmm, maybe it circles around. It doesn't. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. Where did you learn the Imperious Curse? I taught myself. Don't tell Ominous that I've told you. It's not exactly something I can brag about, but it may come in handy. I think you ought to know it. Shouldn't I know more about what the curse entails? Remember the blasting curse? Same idea, except when it comes to unforgivable curses, 
Your intention has to be clear. You have to mean it. Mm. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. All right, time to learn it. There we go. Something troubling ahead. Be on your. It, is there something troubling ahead? Imperio that one if it'll stop for a moment. Oh, don't burn it, my guy. burning up there so I guess we're moving forward bury a spider matriarch put it to the ground I'm not sure how to do that. Oh, Descendo. I'm waiting. Cannot transform. One at an attack. Dang it. The other guy. There we go. Alright. We did it. There is a challenge for doing, uh... Dueling feats, by the way. Why I do them. Okay. Apparently we can't set them on fire with that. That spell will set them on fire. Holy moly. You want one that will essentially beat all other MMO RPGs of all time? Oh, you want an MMO one. Oh, okay. I think, um, what was the Lord of the Rings game? Uh, uh, Shadow of Mordor, Shadow of War? Those two were good games. I enjoyed those. Accio. 
Revelio. I would enjoy games better than that. Okay, this is this catacomb has suffered decay. Just as the student summary described. I doubt anyone's been here in quite some time. Alright, I don't think there's anything else there. But I would love like open world free roam games is it's like there's no going back from them. Once that was like introduced into the gaming world, right, and everyone like started playing those types of games, there was no going back for me. Like, just give me more. I want everything like Another that. Barricade. Considering how well you did on the last one, this should be a cinch. <laughs> how gracious of you! I try. That works. Keep going. Revelio. Hmm. This looks different than what we faced before. Now we're also dealing with rune symbols. Oh, I see. Okay, so that's the symbol. So there are three doors. Okay. We want... We want... That symbol. Action. Yes. Simple enough. Simple enough. Alright, then we want Tetris and that. There we go. And then the final door is this. You are head and shoulders above these bones. And that. Nicely done. Ah. Gimme. There's still some loot that I missed, and I know I missed it. Un unless it's still gonna double back. Hey, what's up, Alaran? How you doing? I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. This place is just downright creepy. Alright. Oh, here comes, uh... Here comes the big one. Defeat all enemies, make a cursed enemy, Imperial defeat another. Okay. Wait, did it not get Imperial or? Oh, apparently already worked. Holy moly, holy moly. Take the lock on off. This game seems to, yes, this game is very, very big. At times, it seems a little empty, though. Like, the open world sometimes seems empty. Or lacking. Wow, the big one just demolished the small one. We don't need Imperio anymore. We'll definitely keep that one on for now. Go ahead and put this on. Oh, whoops, wrong one. We want it to take more damage. For a moment there, I thought that would never end. Now, these caverns that actually have like big explorable areas, they are big. Um, there are some caves you just walk down two flights of stairs, grab a piece of loot, and you're out. And it's just like, would love a little bit more from them, but hey. 
you know. I expect the Legend of Zelda to have all the good loot. Or all the good dungeons for us. Alright, open that. Alright. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. Find the relic. The relic contains abundant potential. Its possibilities could benefit not only wizard kind but the world. But the dark sacrifice would inv involve to realize its intent may be too great. Until we know more, please do not remove this relic. The relic is a triangular bone plate. Sebastian, the relic. Look. That's Could it, it be? The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. I have a feeling I know. I'm willing to ignore what the journal entry says. We're taking the relic. Agreed. This is meant to be. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must keep this relic secret, especially from my uncle. Revelio. Leave the catacomb. Oh man. Oh, we've, we've been spotted. Uh oh. All right. We'll get scolded. Is that ominous? Yeah. Ominous. The sounds we kept hearing. It was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please. Leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. How much did you hear? Everything. I heard you encourage Sebastian to take the relic. Sebastian's done his research. He knows what he's doing. Sebastian makes things sound easy when they could be impossible or dangerous. We need to stop him. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. Sebastian's right. We need that relic. I'm sorry. My mind is made up. Are you willing to sacrifice your friendship over this? I might be. How could I choose to stand by and watch him do this? What if the choice wasn't yours? You wouldn't be to blame for what happens. What in the world are you suggesting? Imperium! That's what I'm saying. I would take all responsibility. This could save your friendship. I know how to cast it. Sebastian taught me. But I won't do it unless you agree. This is insanity! I can't believe you would ask this of me. Sebastian is never going to give up trying to cure Anne. If you try and stop him now, he'll never forgive you. I'm... I... fine. This is unfathomable. But I suppose if you want that responsibility, it may just save what is left of... of my friendship with Sebastian. Remember, this is what I was telling you about the Dark Arts. They come with a cost. You may well regret making this choice. Do what you have to do. Cast it. Before I change my mind. Imperio! Step aside, Ominous. Stay in place until we're out of sight. I will. Sebastian, come on. What did you do? Imperio. It was the only way to get out of here without a fight. Ominous, I'm sorry. Sebastian, we have to go. Revelio. Very interesting. Where is... There's only one thing I want to... Okay, we go up these stairs. 
want to try and get that one treasure chest I couldn't. Thing. You need the relic. I know, but not like this. Ominous and I this way. Surely there's a difference between casting Imperial on someone without powers and casting it with permission. I understand what you're saying. I do, but I've taken full responsibility. Lumos. There we go. Incending. There we go, and this is how we're gonna get this loot real quick. We are coming really close to the 30 minute. In fact, we're over the 30 minute mark, so let me wrap this up really quick. And the bridge is formed. Rickety bone bridge complete. Beautiful. All right, let's see. Is there any collectibles here? What we care about the most? Come through. Come through. Akio. Give me this, this. Yes. There it is. The huge decorated table. It was worth coming over here. And then we open this door. We grab this and this. We scan. Anything, anything. Money on the ground. And right, we're out of here. Um, we go this way. There's probably one more cutscene here. Should see if we can find it. I think this is the exit. Yes, okay. I do apologize for going a little bit over the mark for the recording, but we are almost done. How long would the spell last? How long must Ominous stay in the tomb? The curse is lifted already. He'll easily find his way out of the catacomb just as we did. He'll be all right, Sebastian. Oh, return to Feldcroft. Oh, we gotta go. All right. Oh, we can't. Fast travel. Okay. Can we fly? No. We've run then. Sebastian's worried about his friend. I have a feeling the last unforgivable curse is going to, uh, I'm gonna have to use it on someone. Um, going down this quest line, so. When we get to Feldcroft, I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like ominous. It did only upset her. Uh oh, black smoke. Oh boy. Oh no, this isn't good. What is it? Smoke, over there by the hamlet. All right. In trouble. They're under attack. We're gonna go ahead That's and call right. this video here. We'll see you on the next one. If you're enjoying the series on YouTube, please consider hitting the subscribe button, uh, thumb it up, and I will see you soon. Enjoy your day.